Sa video na to, magsosolve pa rin tayo ng quadratic equation. At ito na yung huling pamamaraan na ituturo ko sa inyo. Gagamit tayo ng quadratic formula. Let's start with our first example, 3x squared minus 5x minus 12 equals to 0. Para sa quadratic formula natin, x equals to negative b, positive or negative square root of b squared minus 4ac over 2a. Kung mapapansin nyo, may mga letters dyan na a, b, and c. Bawat letters na yan ay may katumbas na number sa quadratic equation natin. At kailangan ang quadratic equation natin ay naka-standard form na ax squared plus bx plus c equals to 0. Ang a natin ay 3, ang b ay negative 5, ang c ay negative 12. Insert lang natin yung mga numbers sa quadratic formula natin. Paltan lang natin yung a ng 3, b ay negative 5, c ay negative 12. And then, isimplify lang natin para makuha natin ang value ng x or yung solution. Negative times negative 5 is positive 5. Negative 5 squared is positive 25. Negative 4 times 3 times negative 12 is positive 144. And 2 times 3 is 6. Ipag-add natin yung numbers na nasa loob ng radical. 25 plus 144 is 169. Square root of 169 is positive or negative 13. Paghiwalayin lang natin yung positive and negative. 5 plus 13 over 6 is equal to 18 over 6 or x equals to 3. 5 minus 13 over 6 equals to negative 8 over 6 or x equals to negative 4 over 3. Next example, we have x squared plus 4x equals to 32. Kung mapapansin nyo, ang quadratic equation natin ngayon ay hindi naka-standard form. At syempre, bago tayo magsimula, kailangan ang quadratic equation natin ay naka-standard form. We will subtract both sides by 32 and our equation will become x squared plus 4x minus 32 equals to 0. So ang a natin ay 1, b ay 4, at ang c ay negative 32. Insert lang natin sa quadratic formula. Palitan ang a ng 1, b ay 4, c ay negative 32. After that, isimplify natin. Negative times 4 is negative 4. 4 squared is 16. Negative 4 times 1 times negative 32 is 128. And 2 times 1 is 2. 16 plus 128 is 144. Square root of 144 is positive or negative 12. Separate lang ulit natin ang positive 12 and negative 12. Negative 4 plus 12 over 2 is equal to 8 over 2 or x equals to 4. Negative 4 minus 12 over 2 is equal to negative 16 over 2 or x equals to negative 8. Ngayon, bibigyan ko kayo ng sasagutan para naman may apply nyo yung natutunan nyo. Kung hindi nyo pa napapanood ang completing the square at factoring, ilalagay ko yung link sa baba. Tips ko lang, huwag nyong palilimutan to dahil gamit na gamit ito sa mathematics. Maraming maraming salamat sa patuloy na panonood at walang sawang pagsuporta. Kung may mga questions kayo, i-comment nyo lang sa baba. Shoutout nga pala kay Leo Fruto, John Paul Salvan, Ryan Abelgas, Ramchand Pangilinan.